On today's first look, we have a 1970 Chevrolet Chevelle LS6 convertible. This is lot number 1370. I'm joined here by Mike McCullough. This is a true LS6 convertible, authenticated by Jerry McNeish. This LS6 has its original matching numbers, born with the car, LS6, 450 horsepower, V8 engine with an M22 Muncie four-speed manual transmission and a 12-bolt positive traction rear end. Has the original trim tag, the original components, including the brakes, the fuel lines. I mean, when you go through this entire car, Mike, it is amazing. Original smog pump, starter, carburetor, alternator, everything on this, all the original brackets, the control arms. This LS6 convertible was professionally rotisserie restored. And Mike and I share something in common. Why well, I have Mike joining me here. We, together, I owned what everybody said was the only real LS6 convertible that came out of uh, Dick Bridges collection. Dick Bridges collection. And Mike bought it on the auction block in 2002. It's the very first car I bought at Barrett Jackson. And for a long time, everybody said that was the only true real car. These cars are very hard to find where they have all the original drivetrain on them. And I think part of it is it has a higher gear ratio in the rear end with an M22. This car was not a drag car or a street racer. It was just driven. Tell us more about the car, Mike. Yeah, the exterior is expertly finished in its original code 48 forest green with white SS stripes and a white convertible top uh, over the black bucket seat interior with their center console. And if you ask me, Craig, when you talk about a Chevelle, whether it's a Cooper, especially a convertible, the, the boxes you want to check, this, this car's checked. It's got the cowl induction hood. It's got the Strato bucket seats with the four-speed manual transmission. And like Craig said earlier, it has the M22 Rock Crusher four-speed transmission. 12-bolt rear end out back is featured the 331 rear gears. And that's probably why this car is able to maintain its original drivetrain this long. A lot of people drag race them. They put 410s in the, from the factory, the M22s, and then they run them pretty hard. When I first bought uh, the LS6 Chevelle, uh, Craig, that, that we had sold at uh, Barrett Jackson in 2002, it's the, that was the first experience I had with driving an LS6 Chevelle, and it's changed my mind forever. These cars are absolute beasts. They absolutely are. You know, when I sold the car, I only sold it for one reason. I wanted a car with buckets and a console, not a bench seat. Didn't know I would never find another one that had bomb-proof, absolutely bulletproof Provenance. This car does. Jerry has been through this car, top and bottom. He actually has a drive that has 5,600 photographs of the restoration going through it. It has its 15-inch wheels on it with the oval. I mean, you look at this car, absolutely every box was checked when they ordered this. Jerry McNeish is also quoted in his report in 2015 saying this was the first LS6 Chevelle that he certified with its complete original drivetrain. And according to the McNeese report, this LS6 convertible was further optioned with the 331 gearing, the AM FM stereo, and this F41 special performance suspension. Now the sale does include the McNeese full report and a thumb drive with those 5,600 photos that Craig mentioned uh, documenting the restoration. Best part, this real, beautifully restored LS6 convertible We'll be selling it no reserve at our 2024 Scottsdale auction, January 20th through the 28th. Check it out on our website. Spectacular restoration on a real LS6 convertible. See you there.